Chanaru, Toroku, Ine, Boton, Yorushiku, Onigaishimas. Chanel Toruk. <laughs> you got it, bro. Forward a little bit. What uh, went into your decision to come to Japan? Yeah, so I'd, I'd actually just played with Deshaun Thomas, who was here in Alvark the last year. I played in Ephesus and obviously I was hoping to stick with uh, I was hoping to stick with uh, Euroleague. I, was, I thought I, you know, kind of did okay at the Euroleague level. I was, but I was ready to have like a little bit of an opportunity and hopefully stay with uh, Anadolu Ephesus in Turkey. And um, yeah, I mean, they ended up going in a different direction uh, with another European big man. And after that, there like wasn't like a ton of options. There were some some uh, a couple offers in spain that i was i was thinking about taking and then um i mean i think we understand toyota um yeah they can kind of financially back some stuff so uh i was kind of like all right like let's you know this is a good i just had played in china so i had i'd made uh you know i i did pretty well in china and ended up getting cut um but um, that's how I ended up in Turkey, but I was like, all right, I mean, I, I think I could handle, um, I handled China. Like I think I can handle Japan and it was a good contract, like money wise. And everybody sounded like the situation was, you know, one of the better ones in Japan. I mean, really, I didn't know anything. Um, but I was like, all right, let's, uh, you know, let's give this a shot. How would c- you compare your situation with Toyota in terms of like the facilities and all the resources available compared to say the EuroLeague, uh, NBA or China? Um, yeah, I mean, I definitely think Toyota is better than, you know, my year league experience. Um, honestly, like, I think, you know, I think we have like, you know, probably one of the, like, I think Toyota's setup is probably one of the better in, um, um, like practice facility wise is in locker room and all that kind of stuff is better than, um, you know, most, a lot of the situations in Europe. I mean, obviously I didn't play for the Barcelona's or Real Madrid, but Anadolu Ephes was a great situation and they had a practice gym, but, and they had a, you know, weight rooms and stuff, but I'd still say Toyota's situation is a bit better. I mean, now there's not quite the arenas like there was in, um, in, in EuroLeague and stuff like that. Those are some pretty nice arenas in Turkey and Spain and all those different places. But, um, not that the not that playing in Tachikawa was that bad, but it's it, it's not quite an arena. It's more closer to like a field house or something like that. But uh, yeah, I mean, it was that was probably the biggest difference. But overall, our practice facility is is pretty solid here in um, in Toyota. Yeah, I noticed that difference too because I played in the I only played in Europe one year and it was in the uh, BBL. Mm-hmm. And in yeah. that league, they all play in stadiums, and it's like these huge gyms, and you're yeah. like, man, they're putting. 10,000 people in the stands, you're like, bro, this is, and they like love it. Like, they're like all yeah. into it and everything. Yeah. So, that was a bit shocking to me my first year because it's not on that level here yet. Yeah. It's definitely, it's definitely getting there. You know, Japan's, a, Japan's different. I mean, fans wise and all that kind of stuff. I mean, I, you know, I played a yearly game in Serbia and there was like, I think it was like 28,000 people there, like mm-hmm. saying every word possible to you and fireworks going off. And, you know, we played the, I think we played the quarterfinal or the semifinal in uh, Olympiacos when we were there. And like, I like, I mean, that was, but with the, we ended up losing in game five and like, it was like legit scary. Like, it was like, we need to get out of here. Like we yeah. need to leave right now. Like that, that's, uh, that's something I don't think <laughs> will ever make its way to Japan, but yeah. No, no, there's too much respect in the culture here.